So this is a message for the judges, barristers and solicitors working within the family courts here in the UK. The author of this vignette used to sell unsecured professional finance to your industry on behalf of one of the largest financial institutions in the world. In 2012, we were categorically told that we could no longer provide finance to family court professionals such as yourselves because the vast majority of you relied for about 75% of your income on legal aid. With legal aid cuts coming in, that made you uncreditworthy. Unless, of course, you could prove over 50% private practice pre-legal aid cuts. The only finance we could provide post-legal aid cuts was for professional indemnity insurance. As a lot of people might remember, those legal aid cuts caused quite a stir for your industry, prompting quite a lot of you to start pounding the streets, carrying placards, saying that if legal aid cuts came about, it would result in serious miscarriages of justice, especially for domestic violence victims. As you all know, because of something called LASPO, domestic violence gateway applications increased exponentially post legal aid cuts. This is because if you made an accusation of domestic violence, whether there was any proof or not, this would normally secure legal aid funding for a female going into family court. As you are all aware, more recently, the guidance for DV gateway applications has been widened, meaning that it is now easier to make a DV gateway application, i.e. it is easier to make an unfounded accusation against fathers, which secures your funding, thereby securing your mortgage, the down payment on your cars, all of those lovely luxuries you all enjoy. The false accusations you're all making so that you can live a better life than everyone else are the single biggest contributor to male suicide in the UK and you would have to be an idiot not to see it. We know what you're doing and we are coming.